Hey everyone. So by now, hopefully we've all recovered from our uh, New Year's hangovers, and uh, we're going to take another look at some uh, TSA Travel Century uh, padlocks. This is uh, one by Brookstone. It's a four-wheel combination lock like a lot of the others that I showed you before, uh, but this one is a bit different from the others because if it will focus, there we go, you'll see it's the TSA 003 uh, control key that's used here, and if we can get in nice and close, you'll see it has a rather strange keyway. It's very, very small, uh, and it has this wide flare at the bottom uh, to help insert the key, but that also really makes it very, very difficult for us to tension it. But luckily, at least on this one, it has this nice, heavy uh, collar that turns. So we can actually just tension this with our fingers. No uh, no tension tool needed. So let's uh, get this in the vise. Actually, you know what? I'm going to try doing this by hand because uh, hopefully it'll get better focus that way. So uh, this one is going to need to be rotated counterclockwise uh, because you may notice that it's slightly off-center and so it's actually going to pivot from right around here. So we're going to just uh, brace the shackle and body with two of our fingers and then use our thumb and index finger on that collar to apply some tension. And we're going to take our old friend, the, uh, the Bogota uh, Jiggler, and stick it in there. And we've already got that's one pin and open. So, just remember everyone, even with these really tiny, awkward uh, keyways, there's almost always a way uh, to tension these things and get in there. So, until next time, happy picking and happy new year.